What's up, Trap Fam? You chopped it up with your boy Kevin? And today, we're making an all time classic, baby trap fries. Stay tuned and check it out. So, the first thing you want to do, get a pot of water boiling. Hey, while you wait for that water to boil, go ahead and crack the ramen. Got the chicha ramen, then our Tupperware. We're also going to need some hot Cheetos, some ramen noodles, some squeezed cheese, and some nacho cheese. You're going to dump your noodles up in the chicharrones. Then put your seasoning pack in there. Put about half. We can adjust the taste later. Next, get your hot Cheetos. And this is very important. Don't use all of them. We're going to save a little bit later for sprinkling on top. But you're going to get... You're going to pour a few into your ramen bag right here. Crunch them up, add some color to the spread. That's what we make when we make a spread. That's gonna go on top of our fries. This one you can crunch up by hand, just like that. More. Get some hot Cheetos up in there. You put enough water to blow all that soup up. The chicharrones are going to soak it up too, so definitely put enough water to cover that mixture right there. All right, guys, so now what we're going to do is get our squeeze cheese, our jalapeno squeeze cheese, and let's get that back up into that pan that we just used. So we'll squeeze it all up in there. We're going to heat this through, and this plus the nacho cheese become our nice cheese sauce for our fries. All right, get you a bag of crinkle cut fries. I really think the texture of crinkle cut is really gonna help, you know, adhere to the spread that we're doing. And just get them on a little baking sheet right there. Spread them out, you want them to get crispy, so don't layer them too deep. We're gonna go ahead and sprinkle some oil on here and put it in our turbo oven. All right guys, go ahead and put some oil up on there. And we're gonna put it in the turbo oven right here. We're gonna do 425, about 15 to 19 minutes, depending on how crispy you guys like it. Let that thing burn, okay? Go ahead and keep swirling it around. Ooh, hot and steamy. Put a little salt. All right, as you guys can see, we got our fries beautifully fried up in the turbo oven. We're gonna layer it, all right, just like some nachos. We're gonna put some nice cheese sauce right there. Get a little base layer. All right. Got your cheese sauce. Then we're gonna get our spread. That's right. Get some of that chicharrones up in there. Really want to get all that flavor. And then, voila! A little more cheese sauce for that texture. Now for that crunch, we're going to put some crushed hot Cheetos up on there. And the last secret ingredient, some sliced jalapenos. There you guys have it. That's trap fries, aka the spread fries recipe. Oh, you guys see that cheese bowl right there? Man, oh man. Bomb. Now I know you guys 
have probably had chili cheese fries. If you're adventurous, you might have had carne asada fries. If you're real off the chain, you might have had DUI fries like my boy Dan and I just did. But I guarantee you never had these Trap Bistro spread fries before. Let's get a taste test. Those fries are salty and crispy. You got the meatiness of the chicharrones. A little kick from the pickled jalapenos, a little tang. And the cheese is just super creamy and rich, man. Mm mm mm. These are fire. If you guys like this recipe, you guys want to see more trap recipes, hit that like button. Drop me a comment. Let me know what other type of trap recipes you guys want me to make. Till next time, guys. Trap Bistro out. Catch you next time.